Meanwhile, a big discovery could be key to fighting coronavirus, and it comes from a team of scientists here in Chicago. CBS 2's Mike Puccinelli is live outside Northwestern University School of Medicine with the promising findings. Mike. Hi, well, researchers here at Northwestern, also researchers at the University of Chicago and also at Argonne National Laboratory, all are part of a 40-member team of scientists that have been called upon by the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Disease to try and come up with a cure for the novel coronavirus. And this week came word of a possible breakthrough. This is a protein gel. And these proteins help the new coronavirus grow. That's why here at the Northwestern University School of Medicine, researchers are trying to figure out how to attack these seemingly harmless looking proteins. But we're already seeing data come out that says that things that were developed for SARS are actively inhibiting these proteins. Dr. Carla Satchel says test results released in the past week are so promising that she believes any drug to treat the new coronavirus will have its roots in the 2003 SARS outbreak. I feel fairly confident that Whatever first new drug comes out, it will be a drug that was originally developed for SARS. The recent coronavirus outbreak is unlike anything she's experienced in 19 years of medical research. So for me, this has been a real exciting. That's because she believes the work being done by her team at Northwestern and at eight other sites around the world could potentially save many lives. I am confident that the research will directly contribute to, to new um, drug discoveries. And she says although a cure wouldn't likely come to market for at least 18 months, in the world of medical research, that's incredibly fast. I don't think I personally have ever worked on something where what we're doing today could have a real big impact right away tomorrow. Now the goal of the research is to throw a chemical monkey wrench into the machinery of the virus. The researchers here are working of course on a cure. Researchers elsewhere are working on a possible vaccine. Reporting live at Northwestern, Mike Puccinelli, CBS 2 News. Erica. Michael, thank you. I'll take it. All the news about coronavirus can be unsettling, and understandably, many people are scared. So what we want to do is put the virus into perspective, offering you and your family facts about the illness. Here's what we're learning. Coronavirus causes a respiratory disease called COVID-19. Symptoms include fever, cough, shortness of breath. Most cases, about 8 out of 10 are mild. The more serious cases can lead to severe lung damage. People who are older or have other ailments like diabetes or lung disease appear to be at greater risk for getting a severe case of coronavirus. To see what you can do to protect yourself and read all about the virus, we've got all that information collected for you. Go to cbschicago.com slash coronavirus facts.